Welcome to Cut to the Chase podcast with myself, Diego Traglia and Aaron Davis. Well, you know, number one agent for Rate My Agent in New Zealand and a burnt out old auctioneer. But we're going to talk real estate and we're going to talk digital leads, Diego. We are. Let's cut to the chase, Davis. So what we're going to talk about today is what you do with a digital lead. First of all, what is a digital lead? I guess a digital lead is something that comes from either Facebook, YouTube or um, Google or those lead generation paid leads, paper leads kind of systems. So normally it comes in the form of a name, address, phone number and email address. So that's Let what me cut lead. in yeah. and just so you can breathe, right? Right. Um, how much do you spend a <clears throat> a month roughly on digital leads do you believe we spend on the digital strategy probably between four to six grand a month okay yeah. good for our listeners to know that yeah, yeah right so the leads come in the leads come in the biggest mistake i used to do is that i used to get excited i get a lead what i'll do i'll call them hey thank you so much aaron for getting in touch with me i'll come and see your house and i'll give an appraisal and they're like no 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 cancel that i don't want it nothing to do with you right yeah they don't want an agent to hound them and uh, arrest them so i've changed my strategy what we do now we'll get the lead in and uh, we're going to give them a digital appraisal we don't go to the house we don't call them we'll just send it to them by email beautiful we'll send them a text message confirm that we send them the appraisal by email and then if it comes from facebook uh, we'll send them a quick video hey aaron thank you so much for your digital request for your appraisal i hope it made sense let me know if you want something more specific i'll be happy to come to the house Beautiful. Okay, so they don't feel arrest. They don't feel like they've been hounded. And of course, with the details, then it goes to the database. And with the database, we'll do various things to get in touch with them on a regular base. So what are those regular things? You've done the soft close. You've sent them an appraisal. Yeah. They're still happy because they don't feel as though you got the claws into them. That's right. Then you don't hear from them. That's okay. Then what are you what are you doing with the follow-up from the database from there, Diego? Well, I suppose you've got to get in touch with them on a monthly base by sending them a letter, you know, send them a text message with a recent sale. You know, uh, let them know about the market uh, in a form of an email or a market update with a link. Um, so we can talk about the database and what we'll do with more details in a future episode. But I think okay. here, here's the key, right? Yep. If you get a digital lead, don't call them and tell them you want to list your house. Because the reality is that they're going to cancel and they're going to retract and ask you not to get in touch with them. And I think that's the biggest mistake that agents make is to sort of get in touch with them too much. Would you so agree? that's the mistake you made early on. I, I made plenty of mistakes. We both know that, right? I'm not for... Hey, you got more issues in Vogue magazine, but that's another story, but all good. So the key is digital lead comes in softly, softly send them the digital appraisal, follow up with feedback and recent market stats. So then how does the conversion happen after that, Diego? What do you find the best success rate now that you've done that? I've just literally got now a, an email um, from someone that I did a digital lead a couple of months ago, um, digital appraisal a couple of months ago, and now they send me an email saying, hey, um, we're actually going to list the house, come and see us. So for me, it's, it's you know, in sales, there is a say, uh, all ABC, always be closing. My philosophy is NBC, never be closing until you're ready to close. So what I do with those digital leads, you get in touch with them gently, you give them information, give 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 at some stage they'll turn around they need an agent and they'll come to come to you because they've seen your name so many times yes. so that is the key with digital leads do not call them do not ask them to sell they're not ready most of the times so i think that is the biggest stake for that i've took over the last few years okay. cool so in summary softly softly and then close when they're ready to close Thank right out well much. good tip digital leads you heard it from the big fella until next time thanks for watching and subscribe, please subscribe. This is our first episode. <laughs> so that's what they say, right? On the all the podcast. Yeah, absolutely. Please subscribe, like it, or whatever it is. We're starting from ground zero, episode zero. We'll see if we can get to 100 episodes, shall we? Let's do it. Thank you for watching. Ciao. Stay in trouble, keep it quiet.